Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, we're gonna see how can we set multiple meeting locations inside the calendars in Go High Level. Now, before we dive into the configuration, I wanna share this with you that multiple meeting locations can only be set either in the event calendar or a round robin calendar with one staff member in it. With that being said, let's dive right into Go High Level. So right now I'm under the calendar settings and as you can see I have multiple calendars set up here. If you do not have one you can easily create one by clicking here and then choosing the type of calendar. For this example I'm going to take a use case of a business who does telehealth visits for patients. So I'm going to go with this event calendar right here. I'm going to click here and then edit. Now once I'm here I'm going to scroll all the way down and under the meeting location you can see we have add location option. So by default we have a zoom link here and you can see if I click on add location I can add a phone number or I can also add an address. So we can get rid of the address because this is a telehealth visit. So some people would like to jump on a Zoom call. So that's why we have a Zoom link here. And then some people like to talk on the phone right away. And for that purpose, we can have a phone number here. So having multiple meeting location options can actually help your users or patients in this case. And this is exactly how it will show up. So they can pick up a preferred meeting location here. So this was about a simple event calendar. Now let's pick up one more example of a round robin calendar and see how that setting would apply here. So you can see I already have a round robin calendar here. I'm just gonna click on edit here. So this round robin calendar is for a solar company. Now if I scroll all the way down, you will see that we have two staff members here and it only gives us one option to add the meeting location. And that is why, because I mentioned in the start of the video that it will only work if you have only one staff member inside the round robin calendar. So let's actually test that right now. I'll just take away one of these here and then you'll see that if I have one staff member, I get an option to add multiple meeting locations so that I can give that option to my users. Now, as this is for a solar company, we can do a Zoom link here and then we can do one phone number here and for the third option, we can actually do a full address in case they want to visit the office, right? So having these multiple location options can actually make it easy for your users to book with you and ultimately have a good booking experience. That was about this video. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments below and we'll get back to you.